Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Okay, let's see who's coming towards you guys. Let's see who's coming towards you guys in love. I like this. Let's see. It's coming towards my collective in love. Okay, well damn. Okay, so somebody feel like a dumbass here, Empress. For being in their ego. Yeah. Somebody feel like a dumbass, Empress, for being in their ego. Because they're waking to see things your way. Something, yeah, happy times are coming here. I feel like whatever hexes or spells, okay, things are over now. All right, so whoever your person is, your person of interest, could be feeling some type of way here, all right, about you. Okay, let's see here. All right, so we have the snakes, um, the snake princess, the serpent's path of power. So somebody wants to do something the right way. Yeah, okay. Something you thought was finished is about to burst back into your life here. Because whoever this person is, they could have been doing shit over or manipulative or whatever this is, okay? But um, they have had a rebirth. Rising of the Phoenix energy here. So they want to do it the right way here when it comes to you here. Somebody that you love, okay? Wow, yeah. So somebody's releasing this anti-hero energy. If somebody was the anti-hero, they're releasing that or they're being, yeah, they're leaving that behind. They don't want to be like that anymore. It could have been a religious belief system that had them in that energy. All right. So they want to know the truth. So the serpent's path is the truth. Okay. The apple. Okay. Um, somebody is like feeling like a dumbass because they are seeing something clearly. They see the truth here. They see that you're their empress or whatever this is, collective. All right, yeah, and they could have, you could have let them go, okay? Some of you guys, okay, they could have tried to sacrifice you, all right? Like, I don't know, they feel stupid. Like, what the hell was I, why would I let you go? Not, yeah, and I'm not speaking literal sacrifice. Somebody just could have let you go for somebody else. Like, that was dumb. Yeah, and they like, what the hell did I do that for? <laughs> Yes, okay, listening to advice, thinking clearly. Like, why the fuck did I do that? When you're held in high honor, okay, you're the ideal partner. All right, you're like everything, royal energy, whoever you are. It's like, why the hell did I leave? let you go? So out of nowhere, all right, it's like somebody just pops up like, where am I, where, where am I empress? I got to call her, I got to, I got to, like, so expect some rapid communication, like, somebody is just, like, waking up out of a daze or something. Like, what the fuck happened? Like, I'm literally hearing that. Like, somebody asked them, like, what happened? Like, like they were in a coma or something. What the heck? It's like, they about to come rushing in. Okay, yeah. It's like, what the fuck? I cannot make this up. Like, yo, whoever you are, somebody is like, oh, my gosh. Like, they know how... You are with your body. They know how loyal you are. Somebody already, if you are celibate, they know you're not out here having sex. Like, somebody knows how loyal you are. I don't know what the heck this person was thinking when they walked away from you. It's like, I like I don't know if somebody said that you had sex with other people or whatever, but somebody know with the loyal and the intimacy. No, you didn't. Okay, you could be a queen of swords energy, right? The snow queen. Right with the frog prince. Okay, so it's like in order order for somebody to have sex with you, they have to be loyal. They have to be a hundred percent all the way in with you, or whatever this is. It's like, why would I have if they had sex with somebody else? They like, oh my gosh, she's not gonna want me anymore, or you're not gonna deal with them anymore. Somebody knows that. Oh, wow. We got survival and obsession. 
Somebody could be obsessed with someone. Okay. Spirit, what is the message here? Something about loyalty. Loyalty is big for somebody. And you were like the... You're like the statue of loyalty. I don't know what this person is thinking. Okay, they could be an Aries. They like, what the fuck is going on here? Okay, like, I really feel that. Okay, they like, where? It's like, yo, I promise you, and there's the snake again. It's like, I'm supposed to be over there. I don't know where this person is, but they're looking at, like, I was supposed to be doing something. I'm not, I didn't do it. They had a duty to do. They had something to do with you. It's my duty. I can't make it up. It's like, bro, 22, yeah, 2022. It's like somebody like, yo, um, I don't know where this person was, honey. I'm really feeling like this person is being reconnected to their vessel. I don't know where this person was, where they was like hiding, but their mind was gone, Sharon. Because they know they made a promise to you. They have a duty to you. You always was loyal to them. You were always honest to somebody or something. It's like, what the fuck? Like literally somebody's like, what the fuck right now? Okay. Yeah. They promised that they would bring some sort of something they promising you. So right now, somebody is waking up. I don't know what happened to this person, but the energy I'm getting is like, they're out of nowhere down to here, okay? Now they're like remembering this duty, this promise they made you to bring something back into balance. They're going to keep their word, all right? Their words are pure and honest, okay? They having a revelation that you was, you was everything, the truth. Somebody is like, wow. Wow, if you were so dedicated, all right, to integrity, keeping your coof about life, you were still sweet. Somebody is just like, what the fuck have I done? It was magic. This is what had happened, and the magic is, is over now. All right, we got that Cinderella vibe there. All right, with the magic slipper, 12 o'clock. So something may happen today by 12, and that's what I'm getting, or whenever you watch this, because somebody did the magic in secret here. Yeah, because they were being greedy. Yeah. So somebody did magic on you guys. Connection. Empress. Somebody was being greedy. They were in their ego. Alright. And they like, yo. <laughs> I'm hearing whoever did the magic. That was the, the most powerful person in this magical group. Like they, somebody like, yo, you deserve the best. And they backing out of something or they just like, nah, I, I, I'm not doing this or something like that. And as I'm doing this, like, I'm really like rubbing my face. I don't ever rub my face nor my chin. Somebody might have a beard. All right. Or chin hair. All right. Like somebody like, nah, man, like, like somebody really thinking. And then I don't know what's going on. Whoever this other person, because somebody really feel like a dumbass, because you are everything, man. Like, what the fuck? I could have, I had a duty. It's like I had one fucking job. Like, kind of energy. <laughs> it's like the universe telling this person, you had one freaking job to do. <laughs> For real. All right, you had one job. We asked you to do one thing. Kind of energy. All right, I don't know. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> I don't know. Let me find some other chords here, loves. Um, okay, I'm going to use these. All right, you know what? I'm going to use these right here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use these two since this is, is, is definitely a strong love reading, okay? I feel it. All right, and I don't know who masculine or, yeah, this is. But it's like they was asleep somewhere. I don't know where the fuck they was at, honey. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Jeez, wait a minute now. Can I? Okay. Okay. Yeah, we got retreat. I don't know why they left you. Yeah. Retreat. They done retreated. Or they about to come retreat with you or something. Okay. The yin and the yang energy. The light and the dark. Um, yeah. All right. So somebody about to come back around maybe to retreat. Like, I don't know. Yeah, they releasing an ex. So release your ex. 
as you clear your energy, okay? So somebody is releasing their ex right now or has released their ex because they remembered the duty. And they're mad, though. I don't know what's going on with their brows, but somebody is upset about what's happened. Yeah, look. Wow. That's the first card out. Okay? <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, somebody was codependent here on someone else's energy here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Let's talk about it. So we have, let your friends help you in the reverse. They like, they're not taking no more advice for these fucking friends. They were supposed to be marrying you. All right. So some friends could have been trying to give somebody advice here to let something go. Oh, they don't fuck with you no more. So they got married. So something happened. I don't know. You ain't let you go and got married to somebody. I don't know. Let me, let, let, let me see. It says, let your friends help you in the reverse. They did not. Let go of control issues. They did not. Unrequited love. It was not. So somebody didn't let their friends help them. They're not letting their friends help them no more. So they know something is not unrequited. So they're letting a codependent ex go. Release your ex. It's time to clear your energy here. Yeah, to get a relationship a chance, work on your yeah, so expect communication. Because that chemistry is still strong between the two of you guys. All right. Heart to heart conversations. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. So this person is about to release somebody that's very codependent, or they released somebody, or you did. All right. Um, and they're about to come communicate with you. All right. Yo, I'm telling you, somebody doesn't understand. It's like, can you imagine you guys waking up like out of a slumber of spell works or whatever the fuck this person was under like that? Like, I don't know how to feel. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Like, I, I promised you, you were my everything. I'm hearing you're everything. Like, you're my everything. Somebody really it says that they're your everything. Maybe they told you that. Wow. You mean everything to me. I just think that. I want to start over. Somebody literally want to start over. They're like, wait a minute. I'm hearing somebody like, damn. Like, for real. I don't know what somebody is like. Really? One, two, three, four. As I say that, somebody is really bummed out. This, this divine masculine. All right. I wonder how you feel because he hasn't talked to you in forever or something like that. They don't know what the fuck is going on. They just learned some new knowledge that you're held in high honor and that y'all have a duty or something. So they could have got a reading for some of y'all. Okay, look, I trusted you in the reverse here. I feel like you trusted them here or they didn't trust you at some point here. I don't want to let you go. But they let you go because they didn't trust you or they trusted you, but they let you go. And it's like, will you ever make things right between us? Maybe you were wondering it. Let's see. Bottom of the day. I feel so drawn to you. Okay. So I want you back. I trusted you in a reverse. I don't. I'm sorry, I don't want to let you go. Because maybe you don't trust somebody. They want you back, though. Or they feel like you never trusted them. But they don't want to let you go. But they want to stop fighting or arguing with you here. They don't want to fight anymore. They don't want to argue with you. Or they want to make something right here. All right, give me one card on I want you back, please. One card on, I want you back. Thank you. It says, when I was trying to move on and forget those feelings, I can't. It says, uh, there's always something that reminds me of you. I want you back. Yeah. Why? I mean, <laughs> it says, this is all so new to me. I'm not sure how to deal with all of this at once. They could be going through that dark night of the soul, 555. All right, they are in alignment now with you, 12-12. Heck yeah. 
So this person doesn't understand. It's like they're going through this situation. They try to move on, but they can't. <clears throat> they can't. I trusted you. They never trusted you in the reverse. Why? I trusted you in the reverse, please. Okay. I'm trying to di distract myself from thinking of you so much in 1111 because I trusted you in a the reverse. They didn't trust you. 1111. Ah, ah, I wanted you to think this connection was on wasn't as strong as it was. Ah. Okay. I wanted you to think that this connection wasn't as strong as it was because I it scared me that I'm so connected to you. So I trusted you in a reverse. So they didn't trust you because this connection was too fucking like, what did you do to me? Like, did you do some spell work on me or like somebody was, what the hell did you do to them? They was trying to distract themselves with other females or other things, work, whatever. It's like, oh my gosh, but they can't get you off of their brain. See, I never believed I would be a sapiosexual until I met you. Your mind is incredible. It matches your beauty. Okay. I don't want to let you go because you're held in high honor and you're noble. I don't want to let you go. What's that? I don't want to let you. Thank you. Okay. Trust issues though. All right. Now it says I need to unlearn my previous behaviors that were built on not trusting others and letting people in. They don't want to let you go, but they got trust issues. Vice versa. All right. Even if you reject me, I will continue to love you from afar. And because in the reverse, I don't think you're going to reject them. But even if you reject me, I will. I'm sorry. I will continue to love you from afar and try to convince you to choose me. <laughs> I know it's bold of me to expect so much from you since I was the one who messed up the connection. But... I don't care. You're my dream come true. Wow. Will you ever make things right? Will you ever make things right? All right. Here we go. Wow. Yeah, honey. I did some research. Okay. Listen. 111. I did some research to understand my feelings for you and realize that you are my soulmate slash twin flame. I keep drafting I keep drafting messages to you, but I worry that you're going to reject me. In the reverse, whoever this masculine is, you're not going to reject them at all. Because this came out in the reverse. So they think you're going to reject them, but you're not. Or you think they're going to reject you if they message you. You message them, whatever. They're not. Because did you know that we're supposed we're fated to spend our lives together? So y'all are fated to spend the rest of y'all lives together, however old you are, no matter what it is. Um, y'all are fated to spend your life with this person. So it's like, I don't know what they don't know what to say to you. Um, they think that if they reach out to you here, they're going to be rejected. They're not. All right. That chemistry is still there. I feel like they just was in a codependent connection here with an ex or something like that. And they had to release this ex or what, however this went. Okay. For you guys. All right. Wow. Hmm. Let's see here. What is the message right now? What does the collective need to know here about this person? Yeah, somebody releasing a low vibe energy. I feel like they had to release a low vibe. Yeah, a low vibe in Virgo. You made the right choice because something is backfiring 10 times 10. Whoever this Virgo is, okay, they got released. You could have released them or they did. All right. So some sort of magic is backfired. Yeah, because somebody only wanted someone for money here. All right. Yeah, so they about to ghost you. Somebody about to ghost somebody. Oh, wow. We got new love is here. M N O R P. Okay. 
So they have a comp. Okay, so whoever this person is, you have new love here. And now they're awakening to this, or this is the new love here. All right, they about to ghost somebody that only want money from them. Wow, he been mad. If you have new love here, your person is mad as shit about this. All right, yeah, on Thursday here, all evil eyes went blind. Because somebody could have tried to hex somebody here. Yeah, or get them sexually transmitted demons. Wow. Wow, a karmic woman. So we have a karmic woman here that has sexually transmitted demons here. All right. So they could have they could have had sex with a karmic woman here, your person. And now they have sexually transmitted demons here. Monday, all blockages is going to be removed here. We got Pisces here. Expect positive changes. All right. Um, 888. It says your life purpose and your wishes are in alignment you are doing the right thing and are on the path of light all right yeah because they're going to ghost this karmic woman here all right uh, aries that was doing black magic here on somebody here an uh, emperor yeah i feel like they didn't know how or what however this is going for you guys all right but their initials m n o p you know all right let's see what else we got here I'm going to let you guys go. Mm. <sighs> Let's see. Yeah, I'm planning a vacation. All right. So y'all going to go out or spend where y'all going to be making love all night with this person. All right. F, first, last, middle, initial, yours it is. All right. It says, I'm going to open up to you soon. I can't hold my love no more for you. So somebody been holding their love back. I'm going to ask you to marry me. I hope you say yes. Wow. Straight like that, huh? We got J, first, last, middle, initial, S, first, last, middle, initial. Wow. All right. So we got... E, first, last, middle, initial, I, first, last, middle, initial, M, first, last, middle, initial, uh, you deserve all my love, A, first, last, middle, initial, P, first, last, middle, initial, L, first, last, middle, initial, we got Capricorn Leo, okay, um, you are, I'm sorry, you are my true love, okay, and we got Sage at the bottom of the deck, okay, so we got Pisces, Capricorn, Leo, and say, all right, so I hope this helps you have a blessed day.